Hey vlog! It's me, I'm back with Amy and Isabel and Hi. Haley's driving. We are headed off on a little adventure. We're gonna go to Tongarero Crossing. It's like, um, what is it? 20? Yeah, around 20 kilometers. 20 kilometers long. And uh, we're staying the night tonight at a little campsite near the start. And then we'll wake up nice and early and do the hike. So uh, you can join us on this fun little adventure. All right, vlog, we made it to our campsite. <laughs> Well, if this is really a campsite, we'll uh, give you a little tour. Um, so this is it, just by a big old cliff face. That's that's what we got, and it's just here's the car, and yeah, this is what we're working with. So pray for us. Um, if you see this vlog, that means we survived. So, anywho, we're gonna put up our little, our little tent, our three-person tent for uh, four people. So we'll see how that goes. We'll snuggle. We're gonna snuggle. All right, vlog. We uh, got our tent situated. Here she is. That is just like the rock face that we're sleeping against. The car's right there. We've all got our sweats on and our jackets on. And then here's our three person tent that we are squeezing four people in. Um, so we're gonna be nice and comfy, but it's gonna be good. Um, we're super excited. And we're gonna eat some PB&Js now, so we're pretty excited. All right guys, what do we have for dinner tonight? Good morning vlog. Packing our day packs. This is what it's looking like. Kind of crazy right now. I have two different packs, but I think I'm gonna take this smaller one. Um, so I'm just putting in all my food right now. Um, there's the tent. I'm just taking it down. Um, we were nice and cozy in it. Surprisingly, we stayed very warm. Um, yeah, so here she is. That's her. So we're gonna take the tent down and then kind of probably have some breakfast and then head on our way to start the big hike. Here, here's Isabel. That's Mount Doom right there from Lord of the Rings. In the, in the flesh. And the runner. Yeah. We're running? Okay. All right. Oh, she's right there. We just ran past a bunch of people. So that we were behind a huge crowd. I don't know if you can see it at all. There's a huge crowd on this board walking bridge so we took our chance we did it but here's what it's looking like right now beautiful day no clouds in the sky praise the lord here's an update this is not doom right behind us there's this cool little geo pool i think and we're about 7k in, I think. Probably around that. 7k, and then the trail goes all the way up, winds up that way, and then over the hill. All right, there's the summit right there that you wanted to stop. Look at that beautiful God's work. How's it going, Haley? I'm feeling good. We did it pretty fast. Yeah, we did. 
Yeah, it's about kept us going. <laughs> How long did it take us? Two hours. Gorgeous. And that's the top, and we are almost there. Update, we're like halfway. So we are taking our lunch break right now. We all made some wraps um, yesterday after lunch, but here is our view. We're just sitting by one of these little lakes. How are you guys feeling? Good. Hungry. Yeah. Feeling so good. Good. It's beautiful. Yeah, this is definitely so amazing to just see God's creation. And I've had a few times where I was struggling to get up the hill and I just had to rely on his strength. And so that was a good teaching moment for me. But anyways, I'm gonna get on to eating my burrito and I will update you later. But I was thinking that they would be hot, but Isabel said that they are not. Um, anyway, oh, there's a little one down there too. Whew, it's getting strong. And then there's some smoke over here that we're heading to right now. It is such a beautiful day, no clouds. We couldn't have asked for anything better. Ooh, let's see what we got over here. Oh, there's some down here too. Is the end. Well, the plan is for Haley to hop on a bus uh, to bus back to the car and then Haley will then drive and come pick us up. All right, we are all done. I have just taken my shoes off because my shoes were not good for my toes. I think my toe, both my big toenails will end up falling off. So that's okay, but also my shoe broke during it, so I don't have this little clip like this one has, an extra clip that broke right off. So that's okay. I also drink all of my 40 ounces of water, but Isabel was so gracious and gave me some of hers. So anyways, now we're just waiting for Haley's bus to get here so that she can go get her car. Now we're gonna do some stretching and maybe play some cards while we wait for the bus. Amy, what was your favorite part of the hike? Taking my shoes off. <laughs> Isabel? Um, hmm, 
I was in the pools. The pools. Yeah, that was probably one of my favorites too. We also had some really awesome conversations. Yes. Um, yeah, yes. We talked about so much and I mm -hmm. feel like it, hikes are always way more fun when you are in good community and talking and having good conversations. Um, okay, what was your least favorite part of the hike? Oh, it was all good. The, it was stinky. The sulfur was really strong. Oh, yeah. I guess probably also the smell. Or going down that one little part, it was like just like oh. so hard to get down. It was just like loose rocks. Yes. Someone did take a tumble. I won't name any names. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I think Miley's favorite was probably towards the end. My toes really started to hurt just oh, no. constantly being jabbed into the front of my shoes. I might have gotten a size too small just because I felt my toes bending in my shoes. So we'll have to make some adjustments on that. But other than that, I really enjoyed it and it was a really good challenge. Uh, what, are your, what are your final thoughts? Do you recommend? Definitely. Definitely yeah. recommend? Definitely recommend. Yeah. We actually, how long did it take us? Four hours without the lunch break? Yes, we had a really good leader over here. She was keeping she was the pace. It. She <laughs> was. She was doing awesome. We had to run to keep up with her a lot. Yeah. <laughs> there yeah. to be like a group between us and Isabel. You can see her up there. <laughs> yeah. And then we catch up, and then uh, we would slowly scoot back, and then we'd have to run up again. So she did good. vlog uh, good news I had lost this and I discovered that I had lost my little uh, cover for my camera lens on the trail I was like where is my camera cover and I thought I lost it forever it was in the car I'm so happy um, so anyway we've been driving for probably a little less than two hours and we are all craving real fruit ice cream because here in New Zealand it's like a big thing New Zealand actually created this machine that makes real fruit ice cream. It's like super special. So anyway, we're all craving it and we're gonna go a little bit out of the way, like a little detour to get some real fruit ice cream before we head back to campus. So it's 6.15 right now and we are um, abruptly turning right <laughs> as I speak. <laughs> and, but good news is, this right is gonna take us right to the ice cream, so. <laughs> Hopefully it's open. Yeah, that's the other thing. Uh, Google's telling us something different than Apple Maps. Um, but the one that closes at seven, we're supposed to get there at 6.51, so they better still be open. We'll get there nine minutes to spare. So we'll keep you updated on that. Um, and they better have uh, passion fruit because that's my favorite flavor. It's open. It's 651. Made it to challenge. We're gonna get some big, some big ice cream. Mmm, I'm so excited. Thank you. <laughs> All right, we did it. I got passion fruit and I got caramel fudge. What'd you get? I got mint chocolate chip, cookies and cream, and boysenberry. Mm-hmm. Okay, is Same well? as me. Mint yep. chocolate chip, cookies and cream, boysenberry. Okay, Amy. Mint uh -huh. chip and boysenberry. Hey, yo, look at how big the scoops are. And how much was it? Like three dollars. Three dollars. This is amazing. Is Praise the day. Lord. It is we a good sun. day. We should, we should sit in the. Mm -hmm. 